Okay, so hello everyone. This is Akshay here and let us proceed with today's question. The question name is minimum operation. So first of all, I was not able to upload my previous video that is of the knapsack for duplicate items. So it's a very standard question. I didn't get time yet, so that's why I was not able to upload it. But in the meanwhile, I'll definitely make a video on this. So till then, kill, let's just continue our today's streak. Yep, so today's question is an easy question and you'll be able to very easily good, uh, get a good grasp on how to solve this question. So we have been given a number, find the minimum number of options required to reach n starting from 0. We have been given a number n equals to 8. You need to start from 0 and you have to reach the given n, right? The only operations we are allowed to do is you can either the double the number that will count you as move 1 you have made and you can even or you can do add 1 to that number. So that also will count a uh, move 1, right? So for this uh, for this test case, I was thinking like this as a very super naive solution uh, that uh, n equals to 8 was given, right? So I was thinking that uh, the one who was to double the number, right? So I was thinking that okay, double, 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 karte chalte hai. and whenever we could not do so, we'll just return the difference. So I was just thinking that 0. Now if you double 0, it doesn't happen, right? So first I have to do plus 1, right? So this count here move as 1. Now in one you can keep on incrementing it, just keep on doubling it. So I will just say one in one star two will give you two, then two star two will give you four, and then four star two will give you eight, right? So the total move you can say here is uh, what four? Here one move counted, one move, and then one move, so it gives you as four. So is it the answer? Is it the answer? Yep. So they have done the same thing. So one plus one they have made it two. Okay, and then they are doing 2 plus 2 star 2. Okay, so 1 plus 1 is also 2 and 1 star 2 is also 2. Okay, so basically you can clearly see that there are one more possible path that you do 0 plus 1. Then you plus 1 again, that is 1 plus 1 will give you 2 and then 2 star 2 will give you 4 and then 4 star 2 will give you 8, right? So that's the one also possible path. But then again, 4 moves, total of 4 moves will be required, correct? Let us see for the second test case. For 7, they have said that they are incrementing uh, that the plus plus move the second move mm, twice right and then there again okay so for seven for so seven they are saying that you have zero you do plus one then you again do plus one so that is one plus one will give you two and you again do plus one so two plus one will give you three then three star two will give you six right so this will be one move one move one move and one move and then six to seven you will reach you get the difference as one right so you can take one more move and total move as five right so I was thinking as क्या मैसेज शुरू कर लिया जीरो प्लस वन तो करना पड़ेगा क्योंकि डबल हमें करना होगा राइट इसे हम प्लस हमेशा मल्टीप्लाई करते हैं चलने एक वाइल लूप इस्तेमाल करने के यहाँ पे राइट कि वाइल वाइल माय लेट्स से माय एम वुड बी पॉइंटिंग टू वन एंड माय काउंट आल्सो वुड बी पॉइंटिंग टू वन ऐसा मैं स move further just in case make two star two will give you four it will give you four and then after four you have you cannot go further that four star two will give you eight right so i just calculate the difference so i will just say count plus equals to m plus equals to n minus m i hope that's visible i hope that's visible yep so what is our total moves here here we have one move here we have one move here we have one move here but then you cannot do double, 4 star 2, you cannot do 8, right? So 8 minus, you, you can only do 7 minus the previous value, previous m value is 4. And you have to do like 3 times plus 1. So it would be counted at 3 moves. So but you will get a very long answer that is 3 plus 1, 4, 5 and 6, right? But instead you would have a lesser answer that is 5. Similarly in the case of 10, we observe something like this. For 10, if I take this approach that I will go to 0, and then I do plus 1 and then keep on just doing star 2. Doubling it, so it would be 2, 4, 8. Now, after this, I cannot double it, right? So, I'll just take 10 minus 8. And here it is, will be 1 move, 1 move, 1 move, 1 move, again 1 move. But here, I'll just do 2 times increment plus 1, right? So, it would be 2 again, 2 moves here. So, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. But this is not the answer. The expected output, the expected output is given you here as 5, right? And if you drive in it, there will, there will be, there is a much more easier path. So, you go for 0, then you go for 1. Then you go for 2, that is 1 star 2. And then you do plus 1, that is 3. So here it's plus move. Here it is also if you take plus or star, it does not, it remains same, right? Here you take again plus move and now you do star. Or even better, you do star. 
2 star 2 and then you do plus 1 so it'll be plus move and then 5 star 2 10 yep this would be the minimum possible moves we can make right so total how many moves we took we take 1 2 3 4 and 5 so 5 move correct so if we reverse it, reverse it, reverse it, then what are we doing? If we observe it, 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 we observe it. So what is the pattern here is that when you were starting from 10, right, that your previous move was for 5, then you move for 4, then you move for 2 and then you move for 1. Similarly in the case of 7, you made a move, the previous move where the value was 6, then you had a move where the value was 3 and then you had a move where the value was 2. Right, and then you had a move where the value was one. If you see, if you observe something here, then what we are doing is that if the number is even, then we are doing, then we are doing by two. If the number is even, but if the number is odd, then we are doing minus one. Right, or you can say four plus one five. But in the case of ob ob observation, we are going from n to zero. Right. Again, if it is even, then we are doing by two, and if it is odd, then again it's even. Right. So again by two, and if it is odd. Then we do minus one, right? And can clearly see this is the first move, second move, third move, fourth move, and fifth move, and that's why you get the five. Similarly, for seven, you can clearly see if the number is odd, we do minus one. If the number is even, we do by two, right? And if the number is odd, again minus one. If the number is even, again by two, right? So instead of saying, instead of like if you have started from zero to n, then you have said this division of two is nothing but the multiplication of two and this plus one, this minus one would be replaced as plus one, right? So we are just uh, reversing the number to ob observe the pattern, right? आप बोल सकते हो भाई आपने क्यों किया? आपको कैसे पता चला कि उल्टा देखते हैं तो शायद मैं आंसर मिल जाए? क्योंकि मैं सीधा करके देख रहा था एन इक्वल स्वीट के लिए मैंने किया मैं एकदम नाइवली ग्रीडली चल रहा था मैं कि बस स्टार्ट टू करते आते लॉग इन में अपना काम हो जाएगा बट उससे हमारा काम नहीं हो रहा था राइट सेवन के लिए हमारे पास डिफरेंस आंसर डिफरेंट आंसर आया सही सिमिलरली टेन के लिए हमारे पास डिफरेंट आंसर आया राइट जिसमें मैं क्या उल्टा चल के देखते हैं कुछ मिल जाए राइट तो हमें मिल गया तो नाउ आर कोड विल बी मच सिंपलर सो दिस कोड विल नॉट वर्क दिस कोड विच वी हैव रिटन विल नॉट वर्क एंड इट इज मच सिंपलर वी जस्ट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम एन इफ द नंबर इज इवन वील डू बाई टू इफ द नंबर इज ऑड विल डू माइनस वन यप सो इफ द नंबर इज इवन वी आर मल्टीप्लाइ डिवाइडिंग बाई टू एल्स एंड माइनस माइनस बट इन ऑल द ऑल द केसेज बिकॉज सिंस सिंस यू आर टेकिंग अ मूव यू हैव टू डू अ रिजल्ट प्लस रिजल्ट इज नथिंग बट the move we are taking right and at the last we'll just say return so let us compile and run and what is the time and space complexity since you are coming from n to 0 in terms of division right so that definitely would be log n base 2 great let us hit the submit button meanwhile it is submitting let us see the constraint as well so n is pointing to 10 power 6 so definitely log of 10 power 6 base 2 will be much lesser than 10 power 8 and that is why our solution got submitted that that's the java code and that is the c process code now let us compile and run Great, the compilation has been successfully, though same code here, it's not a uh, very much change. I have copied the same code in the C++ because there was no more declaration of data structure here, just some variables and while loop, right? So great, we have done this question. So this is my DSR repository. You can start and fork to get help with the source code because whenever I submit a code on the GOG platform, it automatically get pushed into this DSR repository. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow, Pure History K, Day 100, I don't know which day it is. And I will definitely make that uh, knapsack problem uh, video. Uh, maybe today or the day tomorrow, but I'll definitely make it because that's a very standard problem. We must cover that in our DP playlist. Till then, keep learning, keep growing. Bye-bye and take care, guys.